Hey, what's going on, guys? It's your boy Kuda Call Man again. I am back, and I'm sorry I haven't been posting videos for like past three, four months. I uh, I kind of been busy with life, and you know how I promised like one video a day in the summer. <laughs> that's not gonna happen because I'm kind of undergoing, kind of going through hell right now. But that's okay. Oh, that guy with the UMP thinks he's so cool. Ah, oh, whatever. The UMP's garbage, anyway. So, yeah, today I bring you my very first Moab, or Mob, or however you guys call it, and, um, I use it using the ACR with extended mags and the silencer, something that, I, that I've never ever used before, but it proves very useful when you're playing, you know, Ground War. And so, the 45 rounds will really help, and... You also get more ammo out of it, but as I like to say, if you want to get a mob, the specialist package is pretty much a necessity, and yeah. And Sea Town is probably the map to do it because I think like half half my videos are from Sea Town because you know I rocked like I rocked like 69 kills with an ACR, but no mob. Here I get like 54 kills, and um. And a mob. So yeah, all I could say is um, I do use a couple of cheap cheap shots like the FMG nines. I think they're kind of a necessity because the ACR is not going to do all the work in close range. So yeah. So yeah, remember my last one I was talking about the PS Vita. Oh, if I even uploaded that one. Oh, yeah. So I did get that Vita, and all I can say is, it is amazing. It is just awesome. Like, I, out of, like, my four or five years I've been a PlayStation gamer, I don't think I've been, I've ever been more proud to be one, now that the PS Vita has been out. Of course, I never really owned a PSP. Back in the day, I was actually a Nintendo DS gamer, because, you know, the day the PS Vita came out, like, I... I knew that they were going to make another one, because I knew at the time they were making a PS3, and yeah. So yeah, for the games on that I you know, recently got, I recently got um, Resistance Burning Skies on the Vita, and it is it is amazing. Just It's, it's obviously not the best, but for the first FPS like real FPS on a, you know, PS, PSP, PS Vita, like, I, I say it's so worth it. And the multiplayer is really laggy, but that's obvious because, you know, they, they can update it. Of course, it, it, probably, it probably does max out the processor on the Vita. That guy was a gift. And, um, yeah. So... Yeah, that's Resistance Vita. I'm also on the lookout for Killzone Vita, and the Black Ops that's going to be on the Vita. I have no idea when the Killzone's coming out, but my best guess will probably come out in February 2013, three months before I graduate high school. Isn't that great? And yeah, I'm, I'm a pretty avid Killzone, va Killzone fan. I probably would have gotten more Killzone vids for you guys, but... Eh. I decided not to, and, um, yeah, so, I also got Starhawk, and, Starhawk is, it's pretty much the sequel to Warhawk, wait, one more, one more kill, one more kill, wait, let's see this, let's see, oh, mo, mo, anyone else see that, oh my god, I obviously lose count of how many kills I have, because I rarely pull up the select, because I, I honestly wasn't thinking of going for a moment, I was just like, oh, oh, it'll be another one of those 69 kills with the ACR again, but, you know, whatever. Although, I don't, I'm 15 kills away from 69 kills in this game, and yeah, I actually do let up, but who cares. So anyway, with Starhawk, it's, uh, it's the sequel to Warhawk. Um, I haven't really been playing multiplayer that much because the campaign is so long, but it's good because 
As some of you guys know, I'm a pretty avid trophy hunter on the PSN, and I'm just trying to, uh, I'm just trying to get to, you know, level 12 or whatever. I'm already level 9, but Resistance Burning Skies is probably the easiest, uh, it's probably the easiest Platinum Trophy I've ever earned, so, yeah. You know how it is when it comes to trophies and stuff like that, you know, it's just, you just can't stop. And yeah, I also look forward to Black Ops 2, which will be released both on the uh, PS3 and the PS Vita and Xbox, so. So surely, uh, with all those combined, Black Ops 2 is going to be a bestseller, especially with all the, with the, with the uh, eight-player zombies. However, um, there's one reservation that I would have for Black Ops 2 on the console, is that it does not run on an IW 3.0 engine, and because you know how in COD 4, 5, and Black Ops, the IW 3.0, it obviously proves to be very laggy, especially in Black Ops, or like, I don't really think it's just suited for that, but you know. Oh, right here is an interesting feed. And yeah. But Black Ops Vita... I hope they have some form of zombies for it. And that would be great if they did. I'll be playing that all day, every day. And as a senior in high school, I'm always going to have senioritis. And so I'm going to play that in school or whatever. <laughs> and what what can be better than leveling up your, char your character in school? So yeah. Oh, um, earlier today, I, I was actually close to getting a second mode. Um, I was using a Type 95 with Rapid Fire and Impact. And I came, I got to kill number 22. I was so close to making kill number 23, but then a guy snuck up behind me. And, yeah, it was just a stupid way, but I don't know. It, I guess it's what I get for using a pretty overpowered weapon like a freaking Type 95 and, you know. So yeah, um, I pretty much got nothing much to say to you guys, but I hope you enjoy this. Hopefully, you can you can use like the ACR tips and stuff like that. Maybe you you can get a mob too. I mean, you just have to you just have to believe in yourself. You gotta trust yourself, and you know, try not to make any stupid mistakes. And yeah, so hopefully in the future I can post more, you know, MW3 or whatever. I really would like to get a Starhawk video in, but. Maybe once I like you know complete the campaign, I'll probably just you know put up like my my like reviews of it like and that's the thing like like you guys can always tell me like you know how I can try to get a better mob. Although I'll be honest, this mob was pretty fast. I mean, with only like one fourth of the game done, I would say that's pretty impressive. So yeah. All right, guys, peace out. Enjoy the rest of the gameplay. If you're willing to be patient.
Missile inbound. 